So airports have already switched foams in the past few years. Um, airports have moved from the long chain C8 foams to more modern C6 foams, which still meet the specification, but um, don't have some of those bad actors like PFOA and PFOS. And typically what has happened is that you do um, a, a triple rinse procedure, which means you drain out the old foam, you uh, generally rinse the uh, firefighting apparatus, tank, hoses, what have you, several times, and then put the new foam in. What we're finding is that uh, the PFAS um, will bind to the inside of all of its equipment, and it's very difficult to get that uh, residual PFAS to dissolve um, in water. And so what you see is kind of a rebound of PFAS concentrations that's coming out of the equipment from old foam being stored there for so long that's now going to contaminate the new foam.